In the following video we are going to get started with Mail Archiver. You see the main window where your emails will end up after archiving. Edit what is being archived with the setup. Start archiving with the archive button. Select mbox files for archiving with the archive mbox button. The central part of the setup is the plan section where you can select what you archive. Click on the plus button to add a new plan. If you want to archive from iMap then go to the account section. Click the plus button to create a new account. Add your account details. Go back to plans and click on the plus button in the middle to add an email application or iMap account. You can then select the mailboxes for archiving. You can restrict the archival by a date or day range. You can exclude internal emails and you can archive emails with flag or exclude them from archiving. Emails can be moved to the trash after archiving. For IMAP accounts emails are deleted. Select a date or day range similarly to the range for archiving. Select the format that you want your emails to have. You can archive to internal database, FileMaker and PDF. Set the scheduler to archive automatically every day, week, month or quarter. The email viewer has the typical three-pane interface of an email client. There is a list of mailboxes, a list of emails and the details of an email. Search your emails in the shown fields in a simple search field. Or do more complex searches with a filter. 